Alright, here's my latest build. It's uh, called the Mongoose and it's from ST's Rockets as well. So this is my first uh, multi-stage rocket. <coughs> so that's the main rocket body. It recovers on a parachute. That's the uh, the body for the booster section. So they've both got identical fins on them, and of course the diameter is exactly the same. So this is how it's set up for launch. You take um, you take two ST's rocket engines and you tape them together. So the first one, as you can see there, is a B60. <clears throat> so that's a B6 rocket engine with zero ejection delay, and that will ignite the upper stage, which is a B44, as you can see there, and that's that's a B4 rocket engine with a 4 second parachute delay. Ideally this should be a B4-6 because you, you want to give it a, uh, an additional 2 seconds before deploying the parachute because presumably by the time this um, second stage motor burns out the rocket will be flying very fast and very high indeed. However, <clears throat> if you think about it Logically, um, two B rocket engines is only going to have the equivalent power of a single C rocket engine. So if I use just one, if I use just a C rocket engine, the rocket will actually fly higher on a single stage because um, a single rocket engine is obviously going to be a lot lighter than than two, and you've got the um, the impulse of 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 these two engines in one. Um, but I've lost two rockets on a C engine before. No, actually, I lost one uh, on a C, and I lost another on a B. But I'm not confident of launching this on a C C engine the very first time. I think it's just going to um, it's just going to go too high and I might lose it again. I, I don't want to lose my rockets on their first launch again. Plus, I haven't got the experience of launching a multi-stage rocket, so this will be my first time doing so. The instruction also says to um, add a layer of tape around here and here, as you can see. And that just friction feeds the rocket engines to the body a little better. So this part goes in there. So it's a snug fit with the, uh, the, the the rocket engine holder inside and it's a stop at the bottom so the rocket engine stops there and there's also another stop inside here so the um, obviously if you use it a single stage it's going to stop against that stop if you use it as multi-stage it's the rocket the engine is also going to hit that stop and that secures it in place yep it's a good fit um, the launch locks are only on the uh, top, the upper stage rocket body. They are none on the um, booster stage, but that isn't really necessary because the rocket will be guided up with these two launch lugs. And I will launch this as and when weather permits and if I've got time to do so. And when I do so, I will record a video of the launch. Bye for now.